Modern air defenses have a weakness. Iran just exposed it. Iran has released new footage of an upgraded missile test, an advanced evolution of the Kbar Shikan. This isn't a parade weapon. It's a battlefield weapon, solid fuel, road mobile, launch ready in minutes, no fueling delays, no warning window, with a range of 1,400 to 1,800 kilometers and terminal guidance pushing accuracy below 30 meters. This missile doesn't just fly, it hunts. Its maneuvering re-entry vehicle actively changes course in the final seconds, confusing radars and forcing interceptors to react late. And here's why this matters. During the June 2025 Iran-Israel conflict, Iran didn't launch a missile. It launched salvos, hundreds of targets at the same time. Even layered systems like Arrow, David Sling, and Patriot hit a hard limit because air defenses don't fail from weakness, like they fail from saturation. Iran's strategy is simple. Don't build the most expensive weapon. Build one that costs less than the interceptor chasing it. Missiles designed to survive jamming, evade tracking, and overwhelm defense through volume and maneuverability. This weapon reflects 30 years of development under sanctions. Solid fuel motors, guidance systems, airframes, built domestically. No foreign supply chains, no external control. Hypersonic or not, the message is clear. Iran doesn't need perfect missiles, it needs enough of them. And that's the weakness modern air defenses still can't fix. Modern air defenses have a weakness. Iran just exposed it.